for me, water is important because it connects us all. My name is Peter Cameron and we're in Thunder Bay, Ontario and I'm a teacher. I teach everything but music and French. We're passionately learning about the Great Lakes. We live on Lake Superior, living in Thunder Bay. We don't necessarily think about invasive species and declining water levels. We don't think that the Great Lakes are also at risk. This now is what I become passionate about. One day I opened up a magazine and I saw this book review on the water walkers. And it was a children's book. It was about a lady who had walked around all five great lakes in her quest to bring awareness to water. At that point, I just knew I had to bring the book to my students. We found the author of the book, The Water Walker, on Facebook. And so I messaged Joanne, and in contacting Joanne, I also found Nokomis, Josephine Mandeman. I asked her if she would visit our classroom. This opportunity that we have to, to share with Nokomis and Joanne, the author of the book, is incredible. We're all using different words to describe this journey that has brought us together today. A big word is serendipitous. It's supposed to happen. Water has brought us together. We created a Google Voyager story. And Nokomis, this story is the story of the Great Lakes. The Voyager story is one that is basically a thematic adventure using Google Earth along a learning journey. We had this opportunity to write these teacher-authored Voyager stories. 20 educators working in teams of three or four. I sat down with a team and after brainstorming for a long time, we created a pitch for a Voyager story called Blue Gold, Our Lakes, Our Lives. And the idea was we would use Google Earth to kind of take any student on a journey down the Great Lakes. Do you want to see it? The ability to travel is at their fingertips through Google Earth. This is going to be launched on Google Earth for all kids to explore at the end of June. Yeah. We're all born of water. We're all connected with the water. We're all related in that way. Even though we're not related by, by blood, but we're related by water. So water is very precious for us. Right now, you're looking at the new junior water walkers. Hopefully, we will raise awareness. It was just really neat to meet somebody who walked around the Great Lakes and raised a lot of awareness. It inspired me that anything is possible, and no matter how big the challenge is, I should never give up. My students now are motivated to make a difference for the Great Lakes. Our hope is, is that classes throughout the world will carry on Josephine's walk and become junior water walkers and adopt one body of water and work in some way to protect that body of water. I think I would carry it on by maybe spreading awareness and telling the younger kids about it because they're the future generations and then they'll tell their kids and so on and so forth. They're going to be doing a lot of water walking themselves. They're encouraging other, other kids in other schools to do likewise. I know that they will make an impact. Their hearts are in it. You want kids to get excited about coming to school? Have them have the opportunity to make a difference. People listen to kids when they use their voices in a powerful way. The world is in our children's hands. Mm -hmm.